The Indonesian Railway Museum, where the Heritage Railway tells the great story. It is one of the museums that hold the heritage of the Indonesian Railways, the history that varies from historical things and sites, the history that will not be forgotten. The original museum was the Ambarawa Station which was made by the King's Order in 1873, but closed in 1976 before finally reopened as the Indonesian or Ambarawa Railway Museum in 1978 by the Minister of Transportation, Rusmin Nuryadin. All these things began when King William I ordered to build a train station in Ambarawa, a city between Semarang and Yogyakarta. At that time, the station is used to transport troops and plantation goods from Ambarawa to Semarang, becoming one of the most admired and vital in the era, having various types of railways and usage, used and discussed by many public figures, connecting the entire region of Central Java to Yogyakarta via Magelang after being rebuilt in 1970. It is now 50 years later, known as the Ambarawa Railway Museum or the Indonesian Railway Museum. Still having all the well-preserved historical products being displayed and retold, even some of them are still operating for different purposes. The railways which one used to bring natural resources and troops, both from Netherlands, Germany, etc., are still well-preserved, along with all the sites such as the stops in several villages. Not only locomotives and stops, the museum also provides all the attributes such as telegraphs, calculators, and even counter or ticket window, and many more. Making sure anyone can stop by and experience the five specs in the 80s-70s. But there is one thing that never changed. The spirit and passion of everyone involved in maintaining the museum know that they are guiding and preserving the heritage. It's now all set up, ready to serve the experience to some people. Them, a historical ride from Ambarawa to Tuntang. The mountains paddy field and the river view, the same natural view given from the 1870s, slowing down the pace from the city life. Here we have Michael from BBC Series talking a little bit about his experience on the railway ride. Hello, my name is Michael Portillo and I've been filming for the BBC Series Great Haitian Railway Journeys. And today I've taken a ride on the railway with my charming guide Okta. 
who's been telling me about the history of the railway. My program is about history and travel. We've made programs all over the world, and we're very interested in 19th and 20th century history. The ride was really beautiful. We passed mountains, we passed paddy fields, people fishing in the river over a beautiful bridge. Very, very picturesque. We were delighted with the pictures that we got. And the train was absolutely crowded with tourists who were clearly having a wonderful time, including lots of children. They loved it. I loved it too. Thank you very much.